Hey, what's up, guys? Thank you for joining me today. Mr. Freecoiner coming back to you again. I hope you guys are keeping an eye out, taking care of yourselves. Also, just remember, anything I say here is not financial advice. I'm simply sharing my thoughts and opinions. All right. So, several things going on. Number one. The stock market is definitely taking a nosedive. Okay, look, the Dow is down over 500 points. Uh, everything is in red as far as traditional markets, and as far as crypto, well, hey, we're eh, we're kind of a, mish, a mishmash of of red and green, but really it doesn't matter right now, guys. But I do have quite a lot of information. Um, now, some of this stuff has already been covered, but I am going to cover it in my own special way. Okay, so let's get right into it. Number one, BitPay is going to start offering XRP. Now, this is something I've been wondering about for quite a while. I've had a BitPay card for some time now, uh, actually since 2017, and I was actually just wondering when we were going to do it. And, you know, I always thought that once this happened, this is when we will start to see XRP really take off. And here we are at the end, you know, fourth quarter 2019. I mean, who knows what's going to happen, right? So I'm just going to read this uh, first paragraph for you. And guys, you can always check it out if you like. Uh, kind of a, a decently long article. Uh, now, this is by Sunit Wad. Okay. Today we're excited to announce we've partnered with BitPay, the world's largest crypto payment processor, to natively support XRP, which will enable thousands of businesses to accept XRP for payments through BitPay's merchant processing and cross-border payments platform safely, securely, and compliantly by the end of the year. This will allow global businesses to accept XRP without any need for integration or enhancements. Additionally, BitPay's wallet users will be able to store, use, and send XRP in the BitPay wallet. I mean, I can't, I don't have to tell you guys how huge this is. BitPay has done quite a lot of, uh, uh, quite a lot of business. And here, as it says, Global e-commerce retail sales are expected to reach six, six trillion, sorry, by 2022, by being able to cut fees down to one percent. BitPay recognizes there is a big opportunity for merchants to save money and ultimately pass those savings on to on to customers. Okay, so again, huge, huge stuff. I mean, this is going to open up so many doors for XRP, and guys, we know. You know, honestly, I really don't even feel the need to even talk about um, the how much better XRP is than pretty much every other crypto. And you know what? What makes XRP better, obviously, is Ripple and the fact that they have really seen uh, the uh, a better opportunity by kind of rebranding. Uh, not using the X current X via X, you know, X rapid thing, just going to ODL guys, that's huge. And, and I think it, I think it puts, uh, companies in the mindset of ease of use, right? Rather than having all these components that they got to be concerned about, well, what does this do? Well, what does that do? No, just, this is what it does. The name actually speaks to its, uh, its actual function. So, you know, that's that's all that needs to be said okay so now this particular article here is pretty interesting I'm gonna go ahead and go through it so guys uh, just bear with me it's gonna take a little bit of time it says though XRP remains way undervalued everything is actually falling into place and ripples tech growth is ascending exponentially uh, with recent tech team signings, new offers in Europe, expansion of the, of the Ledger network, plus massive website updates, is XRP about to go nuclear? And quote here, hundreds of financial 
Institutions across over 40 countries around the world rely on Ripple's growing global payments network. RippleNet to process their customers' payments anywhere in the world instantly, reliably, and cost-effectively. Now, guys, that's another thing, too. That's something I've been saying for a long time. XRP, I believe it's in wider use than is being let on. Um, here, as you can see, I mean, obviously, it's, you know, related to some of the partnerships that they, uh, Bright Garlic House has spoken about already. But guys, I think it's even in wider use than that. But again, we will see. Uh, moving on, the writing is on the wall for those who can read it. Only today, Ripple CTO David Schwartz said the new tech team was all hands on deck. So, yeah, this is something that uh, was being talked about yesterday. But um, they they have actually uh, brought in a whole new team, brought the whole team. And this is something that Crypto Airy was talking about. Um, guys, this is big stuff that's actually happening. This is a huge shift from what we have been seeing in the last like year and a half. And we've been waiting like right now. This shift, I think, is more dramatic than most of what we've seen in the time that we have been waiting. So I think personally, um, I just can't see things, something not something big, not happening very soon. And when I say big, I'm referring to the price. OK, so moving on. This could be the single most powerful message the Ripple team is sending out with their recent tech and blockchain startup acquisitions. Okay, and says no more X Rapid. So I'm just going to go ahead and because uh, we already know that they went to the ODL. Ripple now offers a single solution, RippleNet, that uni unites the uh, features of all previous Ripple products. This move potentially widens the uses of HR XRP digital asset as one form, I'm sorry, as one form of sending funds all banks that have used the x current product automatically join ripple net bitcoinist okay so <clears throat> moving on and and here this is the uh, what i was talking about the x spring technical team at, at ripple and at their first all hands so this is i do believe um the existing ripple team and i and i do believe there are additional uh, uh team members that are that have just been added but i mean either way it doesn't really matter i know uh, they have absorbed uh, another team of, of very talented people. Okay, so uh, moving on, global mass adoption is be beginning to accelerate, and the masses do not want baffling, uh, want to be baffled with science nor cool space age names, which are talking about the three different names that were being used. Uh, the general populace needs it simple and easy to understand, which in turn makes the technology seem attractive and necessary to modern life. And that's, you know. Uh, the one thing that when I when I was growing up, we had all, all these little cartoons and whatnot that were um, really uh, it, it, it just right now. I think it would make it uh, or rather it's very poignant. Uh, and it was something that they uh, always talked about. It was called kiss. And uh, what that meant was keep it simple, stupid. So, and, you know, that's all they're doing here. And I think it is right on time. OK, so. Uh, moving on, just like mobile phones in the 80s or cars over a century ago, people thought they were not needed. Horses and carts work perfectly well. Cars have literally transformed our world, but not overnight. Cars, cars needed roads, gas stations, similar to RippleNet today and why it is so exciting. Um, and then it talks about here in this quote, the uh, uh, what happened with the Internet. I mean, again, uh, right on point. This stuff is definitely... Uh, what we've seen in the past over and over and over again, and people thinking that crypto or even, you know, to be specific, XRP is not going to be successful. I mean, hey, I'm, I'm sorry, you're wrong. If you are a Bitcoin person, which, hey, I have no pro, I have nothing to say about that. Um, I just think that if you are totally focused on Bitcoin and you're not at all concerned about XRP, in my opinion, that would be a very, a very big mistake. So, moving on here to finish off another reason XRP is going mainstream. Anthony Popliano, who holds 50% of his wealth in Bitcoin, is invest is I'm sorry is in interviewing Brad G. Anthony Popliano previously worked at Facebook as a product manager and before that founded and sold two software companies. Someone just introduced me to oh yeah well anyway you guys have seen that but all right so. What I have to say about this is, guys, Anthony Pompliano, a lot of these people, you have to remember, 
a lot of these people are are wealthy and they became wealthy by making the right choices right uh, and those choices were based on the information that they were able to gather you know that's just out there now any person not hiding under a rock in the last few years but specifically in the I would say in the last year and a half would absolutely have to know that XRP and Ripple are are a freight train that's headed towards success and I can tell you in my opinion Pompli um, Anthony Pompliano would not be ignorant enough to not own XRP now obviously he wouldn't be able to say that simply because most of these people who are um, uh, influencers they are paid to speak about certain things okay even Don, uh, I'm sorry uh, John McAfee has confirmed that so I at this point this is Anthony Anthony Pompliano's way of moving into the discussion about XRP is the reason why he never really talked about it so what we're gonna see and personally I believe guys this is kind of all you know planned out I don't see anything happening just by uh, by accident the fact that he put this out there wanting to have an interview with Brad um, guys to me it's pretty obvious that it was already set up and ready to go right this was just uh, them basically um, I would say th it was them basically coming to us uh, to advertise it there there they had to really kind of put it out there to you know to a broader audience to where um, it would just gather a lot of attention okay so what that what is that attention going to do it's going to start to bleed out to those who are not into crypto who are or just only know about Bitcoin or whatever I mean I personally believe that this is just the beginning of a wider marketing push to get other people get the regular populace into the crypto market that's that's what I'm saying just kind of the fuel that FOMO so we'll see but I personally think this is going to be really really big for the whole market all right so moving on now here Swift is testing ripple for settlement again guys <laughs> what I said in, in videos I mean even in even last year I there is no way there is no way whatsoever that Swift is going to go away and I said this a long time ago Swift is not going anywhere if anything I said that that Swift and Ripple would come together okay and remember all that turmoil that people were going back and forth oh Ripple is not gonna this and Swift is not gonna use Ripple Ripple's not you know Swift is not gonna be around no Swift is a huge company they, they have a lot of money companies that have a large market share and a lot of money don't get pushed out even if the technology is better all they do is adopt it they're not stupid these people have <laughs> the, the the people that are behind this have been around for a long time these companies are not going anywhere now I'm not gonna say that for every company but this is a, an emerging market do you really think that Swift would not take advantage of it absolutely they're gonna be right on top of it they're gonna partner with ripple or however whatever that looks like maybe not just a direct partnership but they are going to use XRP okay this is just another phase in the evolution of this company and they can both exist simultaneously they can exist right along with each other and not cause any issues okay because why because ripple is not trying to be swift okay ripple is providing a service to companies like swift okay so that's just my opinion again guys I hope uh, you know that doesn't ruffle too many feathers but if it does hey it is what it is all right guys that's all I had for you today I hope this uh, <laughs> this video was informative and you know you enjoyed it or whatever but if so uh, and you have and if you haven't done so please go ahead and subscribe if you feel that it was you know worth your time 
and uh, also hit that like button as well as the post notification button so you know when I post it again. Until next time, this has been Mr. Free Corner. Take care of yourselves and God bless.